Hey guys, welcome back. So today's video is going to be my haul video. I asked you guys in my last video if you wanted to see the Ulta haul that I recently did and you said yes. So here it is. I don't have too much stuff, but I do have a couple of things that I've purchased. So let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing that I wanted to show you guys, um, and I've actually been using this because I got this on Friday or Thursday, don't remember. But I went to Macy's to see if my Macy's sold um, Anastasia Beverly Hills because I've been dying to try their liquid lipsticks and uh, I don't want to order online. So I went to see if they sold any Anastasia there. Unfortunately, they don't. That's Utah for you. I was super bummed out. But while I was there, I did stop by Clinique because I've heard um, Nicole Guerrero on YouTube talk about this. This is a Clinique Dramatically Different Moisturizing Gel and I am super, super, super oily. So I've been wanting to try a really lightweight moisturizer. I do have the St. Ives um, Timeless Collagen uh, Moisturizer and it's amazing. But I want to try something new. So I picked this up and they had a sale going where if you purchase um, any full size Clinique products, you would get two travel size products for free. I got um, the pretty much like the steps, the one, two, three steps. Um, this facial soap, I actually own the big bottle because my boyfriend got it for me for Valentine's Day and I love it. And then I've been trying this. This is a clarifying lotion and this is for combination oily skin. So far, I really, really like it. Like I said, I own this one already. So I think I'm going to go back and purchase the big size bottle because my skin has just been feeling really nice. And then obviously the third step is your um, moisturizer. It's really lightweight and it's a gel consistency-ish. So it's not too overpowering for us oily girls. I really do like it. Like I said, I've been using it uh, twice a day um, at night and in la mañana and I really like it. And then, um, let me see, the rest of the stuff is from Ulta. Like I said, it's nothing too drastic, but um, NYX actually had a sale yesterday or today's was today, Monday. Um, Sunday, they had a sale on Sunday where all the next products were 40% off and I went ahead and checked it out now um, I got some eyelashes because I'm running low on my eyelash stacking game so I picked these up this is these these are the eye <laughs> these are the eye, eye lore um, definition lashes number 126 and if you can see them they are so pretty they're really nice and like fluffy and they have like little spikes they're spiky i like really dramatic eyelashes i really don't like um natural lashes unless i'm doing no eyeliner and no eyeshadow other than that i like really dramatic ones these are so pretty and if i am correct i think i i think i heard casey holmes talk about these a while ago and this is the first time that I've seen them and I really like them. They're really pretty. Uh, so yeah, these are number 126. And then the second pair, I've been hunting these down. These are also by Ilor. These are the Vegas Vegas Nay lashes. And these are in Grant's Glamour or Grant Glamour actually. And I don't have them here because I have them on my eyes. These are so pretty. I am obsessed with them. I knew I liked them the moment that I saw them on Instagram. And they've been out of stock at my local Ulta. So I had to go pretty far away to get... I mean, not that far away. But I had to travel, you know, to get these. And these were the last pair. So that just goes to show you how crazy and, yeah, how popular these are. I will insert a picture here just so you can see them. And I'll show you up close of how they look. They're so dramatic. They remind me a lot of my favorites lashes which are the goddess lashes by coco these are so so pretty so i got those like i said it was the last one otherwise i would have you know gotten more all right so next oh yeah i have this powder that i've been eyeing for the longest time and i just couldn't get myself to buy it but i finally did this is the laura mercier highlights it's a matte radiance baked powder 
this is a highlight in the number 01 and this is what the packaging looks like Whoa. the little plastic just fell out it's really 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 pretty i haven't tried it out because i'm wearing another highlight that i might have bought a couple of days ago but i have been wanting to try this and like i said i haven't tried it yet so i will let you know how i like it but it's a really pretty like a beige type of highlights and oh i have just been crazy over highlights i don't know what's up but i just love highlights as of right now i don't know if it's because of the summer or what but I love them so this is what the highlight looks like as you can see it's not matte at all whatsoever and it's so pretty I'm excited to try it out I really hope that it works good with my skin so the rest of the products are going to be NYX again because that's mainly what I went in for um, let me just take these out so I got this NYX white look liquid eyeliner and I've been wanting a white eyeliner for the longest time and I've never found one. If you guys know of any really good maybe like gel eyeliners, let me know. But I got this one and it's just like on a little wand form, which I'm okay with because that's what I know how to use. So that's what it looks like and let me see. That's pretty pigmented actually. Hmm. I wasn't expecting that. And then I just got a couple of eyeshadows that I've just kind of been eyeing. Um, the first one is this one which actually matches my shirt today. This is called um, Electroshock and this is just their hot single little pots. This is what it looks like. I don't know why I've been into blue eyeshadows and I don't like blue on me but I like this eyeshadow. It's really pretty. It's a little bit it's a lighter version of this but it's gorgeous and then I got some of the new prismatic or pris yeah prismatic eyeshadows I got this really pretty can you see that oh that is so pretty this is in the color liquid gold and it is just gorgeous I've been swatching these and they are breathtaking it's this one right here it's that one so pretty i can't wait to do some really fun tutorials and then the next one that i got is smoke and mirrors and this one is just like a really nice dark gray because i want to do more cool toned colors here on my channel so that's what that one looks like as you can see it's very nice and dual chromatic almost it's oh it's so pretty and the last one, oh my god, I am in love with this one. This one is called Mermaid Serene. I put Serene Mermaid, I don't know. But it's this amazing, beautiful turquoise color. But when you swatch it, it has the most beautiful dual chrome colors I've ever seen. When you turn it around it has like yellow and like a little bit of like green and i don't know if the camera will pick it up but it is so pretty Ugh, if you don't have this you need it i also picked up the nyx angel veil because again it was 40 percent off i did wear it underneath my skin today so far i like it but i will have to keep you guys updated um and then i also got some um lippies i got this one actually this is one of their nyx um soft matte lip creams and these are my favorites from nyx this is in the color adiz ababa adiz ababa i believe that's how you pronounce it but it's just a really nice magenta pink and i got a matching color or a lip liner to go with it and this is in the color pinky rose which is this one right here and then this is the color of the lip cream. They're like literally spot on, a perfect match. I also picked up this NYX Glam Liner Aqua Lux Waterproof Eyeliner. And this is in the color Glam 24 Carats. And it's just a gold eyeliner. It's really pretty and I have an idea of what I want to do as far as a makeup look with this. But we'll see. 
it's that one right there it's that gold one super pretty the last thing that i got was the nyx um tame and frame tinted brow pomade um i do have my anastasia one but i'm running out of it and it's drying so I just wanted to give this guy a try. I've heard pretty much everybody saying that this is a dupe for it. And I got mine in the color black. That is everything that I got. Like I said, I didn't get too much stuff. But I just wanted to share with you guys the stuff that I got. Because I like to see hauls. And I know you guys like to see hauls. So thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.